Hello Aries, welcome to my channel. My name is Isabel from the tarotempress.com. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm going to be doing your tarot card reading now. Now, what I see from the tarot cards is that there's this element coming through that is resonating with either marriage or commitment. So some of you may have been married to a person or perhaps one party is married to another individual. In some cases, both you and this individual could be married to other people if the two of you are not married to one another. But it relates to that context as well. I'm sensing from the energy of the individual you are dealing with that during this period of time, they want to communicate to you. But they want to do it from a peaceful place. It's almost like they want to extend an olive branch to you. They want to make peace with the situation. So if this individual has done something, to hurt you, offend you, or to cause you pain. There's a possibility that they want to reach out and communicate an apology, perhaps even ask for forgiveness. When it comes to your energy, I'm sensing that you are open to the possibility of whatever this person is going to offer. But first, they need to do the right thing. If they've caused you a great deal of pain, if they've caused you a great deal of sadness, you want this person to rectify their wrongdoings before you even engage in the new beginning of a relationship or reconciliation. Whatever you're going through, When it comes to their mind, I'm noticing that they're trying to be as patient as possible. They are feeling a little bit lonely during this period of time. They're definitely going through something in which the reality of how alone they actually are on this world or in this world. So it's all catching up to them. What would they like for you to know? For some reason, this individual wants to come back into your life. They could have a fear of loneliness, a fear of not being in a relationship or growing old by themselves. But I feel like they have this deep fear that they might end up alone if they don't make things right. Now, it's not easy finding someone that you are compatible with and click with on so many different levels. So it's completely understandable to know that some individuals are more attached to certain souls than others because it's hard to find that. It's hard to replicate that type of love, that type of connection. I see that this person is hoping to immerse themselves back into your life. And they feel like if they were given their chance, it would make them feel extremely happy. Now let's get some clarity in these cards. So what I see from this card here 
in combination with the first one reflecting their feelings. And this person is fighting to be in a relationship with you. But there's also an inner battle that's going on within them during this period of time. It's revolving around the fact that they've been fighting their feelings for so long, trying not to allow it to control them. But they've had this realization that it has more power over them than they have over themselves. When it comes to your energy, some of you could be wanting to move on or you could be wanting to see some massive changes in the situation. And if you don't, you're not going to be willing to progress. You're not going to be willing to give them a chance to prove themselves. So they really have to be on their A game in order to catch your attention again. So I see that they want to work things out with you because they've been feeling lonely. They've been trying very hard to be as patient as possible. Let me mention some of the energies that I'm picking up here. I'm seeing Pisces and Aquarius. I'm seeing Libra. I'm seeing Sagittarius. I'm seeing Gemini, Libra, Aquarius again. Those are some of the energies that I'm noticing. There's Virgo, if I haven't already mentioned it. Now, in terms of what they would like for you to know, this individual is hoping for either a commitment of sorts. And I'm getting that on this card as well as this one. So that's a very strong energy when it's replicated in two different decks. I'm going to be exploring the balance of these tarot cards on the Elite Tarot Society as well as a single extended reading. You can find the links in the description box below. If you want a personal reading, you can get it at thetarotempress.com. Have a wonderful day and take care.